Denmark is at the forefront of a global change in energy efficiency. It has set itself a goal of becoming a CO2 neutral country by 2050. The political willingness is there, and technologies such as Smart Grid promise to deliver a low carbon society. However, shifting from consumption driven power generation to production driven electricity poses some serious questions. How can we minimize the business uncertainty that comes with relying on more fluctuating energy such as wind and solar power? Could the key be in the hands of the consumers and their willingness to be flexible in their consumption? Can we acquire this flexibility and trade it as any other commodity to make the system more efficient? iPower is a research program that develops tools to control millions of flexible consumption units. The concept is to turn power consumers into suppliers of flexibility. Here is how it works. Consumers set their consumption limits. They decide what their comfort zone is and voluntarily offer their flexibility in exchange for savings on their energy bills. As we are speaking, we have pilot products running where we are buying customers' flexibility. Financially, that seems very promising. Apart from the lower prices, the key focus is certainty that the customers are flexible when and where we need it. A professional helper, or an aggregator, gathers a portfolio of thousands of these flexible consumers in what could be compared to a mutual fund. Large consumers of power can also join their local aggregator. We are already mobilizing large consumers to serve the TSO's uh, and services markets, and we are quite open to also serve the distribution grid companies as well. The grid infrastructure owners, or DSOs, and the aggregators meet at the Flexibility Clearinghouse, or FLEC. FLEC is a market-based platform. Think of it as an auction house. At FLEC, the DSOs post their demands for local flexibility. Aggregators have this local knowledge and compete amongst themselves to supply these demands at the lowest price point. The winning bidders are awarded the contracts. When the need for flexibility arises, the DSOs activate their contracts to divert the load as previously agreed upon. The delivery of flexibility is measured and payments are made accordingly. Another advantage of Fletch is that the participants are held accountable for their contracts. That certainly increases the trust to the market platform. Systems like Fleck are already being implemented successfully. In the United States, the largest aggregator optimizes 7,000 megawatts of power. That's more than the entire Danish peak load. Distribution companies and retailers should take a close look at this. In iPower, we expect that this will provide significant value in the future. Everyone is invited to participate and shape the future of energy distribution. iPower helps create our new energy future.